UN urges Saudis to stop Yemen blockading Tehran FNA The heads of three UN agencies, UNICEF, WHO and WFP, urged the Sadile military coalition on Thursday to lift its blockade of Yemen, warning that untold thousands will die if it stays in place. The heads of three UN agencies issued a joint statement, calling on Saudi Arabia to end its protracted blockade of the Yemeni coast, warning that untold thousands will die soon if it is not lifted, the Middle East I reported. UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres wrote to Saudi UN Ambassador Abdallah El Moulimi to warn him that the blockade was already reversing the impact of humanitarian efforts, UN spokesman Stefan Duharic said on Thursday. The Secretary General is very much disappointed we've not seen a lifting of the blockade. The Secretary General and his humanitarian team are heartbroken at the scenes we're seeing from Yemen, Duharic told reporters. The Saudile blockade has been in place to varying degrees since early 2015, causing widespread shortages and many deaths. Lack of medicine led to what is believed to be the worst cholera epidemic in history, killing thousands. Northern Yemen has since run out of most cancer medicine and insulin, with warnings from doctors that the death tolls for people with certain illnesses would quickly escalate to total extermination. Even the untold thousands warning is just a near-term estimation, with northern Yemen down to its last few weeks of food, and chronic malnutrition across the region could very quickly lead to a famine threatening to kill millions. Saudi Arabia has made no indication any easing is coming in the north, saying they were open to reopening loyal ports in the far south, but also bombing North Yemen's lone airport to ensure no one tries to deliver medicine by plane.